made his rather a little nervous though. Tom, the albatross, just showing his wingspan there. And he's up against the Badger. Not often you see an albatross against the Badger, only on Britain's strongest man. And they're off, Colin. 46.56 seconds to beat then by Luke Stoltman. And no surprise that Tom Stoltman, that big stride, those big mitts as well, lifting up the objects with ease. Stoltman's height really helping him here. As he runs back to collect the sack. Now those are about 25 stone, those barrels. These are a little bit lighter, probably 22, 23 stone. But it's a horrible dead weight. Well, Stoltman now taking on the tyre. Yeah, he's a whole implement ahead here. He's got just under 10 seconds to beat his brother. Let's see what the charge is like. Well, this looks very good indeed. <laughs> Look at that, Tom Stoltman, all five in 43.09 seconds. In your face, big brother. <laughs> the Welshman finishing off here. He's got to do it in under 60 to register this final implement. Hands off! That's great, excellent work. Just managed it, 59.79 seconds. And he'll be relieved with that, but just a great performance from Stoltman, the younger. Stoltman's one and two. Well, he's really thrown down the gauntlet there. And the next and final pairing, Mark Felix. And up against the man who is just having the time of his life at the moment, Adam Bishop. And a good recovery, Felix, considering he got zero points in the first event. That deadlift, but Bishop, of course, beat him. These are the final two to go here in this loading. 43.09 is the time to beat, and that does not look as quick as Tom Stoltman. It does not. It's still very quick, though, from uh, Adam Bishop. He's struggling slightly there. Well, just leaning back, these are incredibly heavy, 150 kilos. Terry Holland's in the hands. Now onto the sack. First of two. Now the fatigue starting to kick in, the lactic acid. Felix, those big hands are his. No problem for him to grip onto it. Here we go, the last sack for Bishop. He'll have to turn and go for the 100 kilo tyre. He's certainly not going to beat the younger of the two Stoltmans. 15 seconds to get that tyre into the back of that truck. Hands off. Manages it. 51.46. But what about Mark Felix? Well, I'm not sure he's going to do it. Come on, Mark. No. Doesn't quite manage it. Four objects in 60 seconds. Going to do all five to get a split time. But an amazing performance there from uh, Adam Bishop. Have we got the scores? Let's have a look. Let's, let's see where we're at, if we have them, folks. And there they are, Colin. Fantastic stuff from the world's brawniest brothers, first and second in the loading race, with the slim down Terry Hollands displaying impressive pace and competition leader Graham Hicks only placing sixth.